Hello guys, so welcome back to a brand new video here today or pawn at my channel guys. Today my friends, welcome back to Call of Duty Mobile. And today we're going to be showcasing two things that have been added in, in this brand new season. Obviously, and that is the new weapon, which is the machine pistol. Last time we saw the machine pistol, I believe it was Call of Duty World War II, but it's recently been added into Call of Duty Mobile. And obviously, the multiplayer map, Frequency. And if you guys have played Black Ops 4 before, then you would recognize this particular map like I do. <clears throat> so, brand new map, brand new weapon. Let's showcase it and let's have some fun with it. Obviously, what I've done with the uh, machine pistol is that I've like, obviously used my weapon XP cards to unlock all the attachments. I've had a little play around with it and I found that you can burst this weapon. So it's like, I've kind of turned it into like a mini burst SMG, even though it's a pistol. So this should be fun. And obviously I do like this map as well. It's pretty good for like objective game modes and stuff, like obviously S&D and stuff. So, and obviously like domination and hardpoint. So I like it. Kill confirmed. Targets in sight. Enemy down. So I mean, it's just like a little mini SMG, man. It works wonders. I like it. It's gonna be fun to obviously get the camos and everything for it. Enemy contact. Targets in sight. Enemy contact. Reloading. It's like a 40 round mag on this thing. It's crazy. Targets inside. Over there. I got shot. In there we go. Dropped him, boys. Dropped him. Let me know your thoughts and opinions down below in the comment section. What do you think of the machine pistol within COD Mobile? Do you like it? Like, I think it's alright. Personally, when it comes to, like, particular weapons, I feel like we need a new marksman rifle, because I feel like it's been a while since we last had one. Um, yeah, so I feel like we need a new marksman rifle. Kill confirmed. Wow, proper lag. A friendly guardian is inside. Kill confirmed. But if they have to introduce any more pistols to the game, I would like to see the RW1 from Advanced Warfare being added. That I feel like a pistol will be like a machine to use. In case you aren't familiar with it, it's basically like a sniper pistol. Target down. Like back in that game, you could have like like beating people across the map with it. It was insane. Eliminated. Keep an eye on the minimap. I know you guys can't see the minimap because obviously my face cam's in the way, but I'm just keeping an eye on it, man. Enemy down. A nice little streak at the moment. We'll keep this momentum going. So we could try a push for a nuke. I doubt it, but we'll, we'll, we'll just try our best. You never know. But at the same time, I just want to take this, like, the vibes in, obviously, with revisiting this map after all these years. Because bear in mind, Black Ops 4 came out quite a few years ago, and I, I used to play this map quite a bit. So it's like, it's nice to see this map return, and obviously, it's nice to see, like, more Black Ops 4 content in this game. Because obviously, I'm so used to seeing a lot of Modern Warfare stuff, and... So it's nice to have like a little bit of a, a little change, a, a little change up, I should say, of like of stuff. So we've got a pistol from World War Two, called World War Two, and then we've got a map from Black Ops Four, which I think is nice, man. Emergency airdrop is inside. Obviously, the emergency airdrop as well is one of the new score streaks they've added in with this season. In case you aren't familiar with it, basically it's a care package. Well, it's like a streak that drops in like multiple care packages. So if you get your luck right, you can get loads of like good score streaks to help you. Especially if you want to go for them like high kill games and stuff. So I think it's pretty good, man. I do like it. Oh. 
It's like, ah, oh, you beat me to it. Third play. Enemy contact. UAV recon is standby. Ready to jam enemy UAV. UAV online. Counter UAV is up. Good work. Come on, we can do this. One thing I definitely want to see like happen in the future for COD Mobile as well. Not only do I want to see like obviously the continuation of new battle passes, etc., but I want to see zombies have like an updated battle pass. And so that it brings in some fresh new rewards. Also have zombies have its own camo grind where you can obviously unlock exclusive zombie theme camos that you can use in multiplayer and battle royale but you have to grind them out within zombies i feel like that will be really good but that's just my thoughts and opinions i feel like it will just keep give the game a little bit more of a, like a grind to it and obviously with like some of the new introductions they brought in with modern warfare 3 where you've got like these xp camos that you can grind out to unlock and stuff like that. I feel like they could add that sort of thing to this game. I know they got the diamond camera, which is like obviously you play a certain amount of like games by doing a certain challenge. But imagine like you have to grind up say a million XP and unlock like an ultimate like mastery camo or something. I feel like it'd be pretty cool. All right. So this guy got the last kill. Fair play. Need to manage to get the nuke with the machine first. Of all. Anyways, let me know let me know your thoughts and opinions down below in the comment section. What do you think of the machine pistol? And what do you think of the multiplayer map frequency from Black Ops 4? Like, are you happy to see these sort of things being added into Call of Duty Mobile? Let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comment section. Anyways, if you want to see even more COD Mobile videos in the future, then all I ask guys that you give these videos a big fat thumbs up. And subscribe if you're new. Would really, really appreciate it. Got plenty more content still to come. And as always, I'll catch you all again next time in another video real soon.